coming up today on YOLO Texas. Folks were trying to figure out a way to make Luther make a name for itself. They said, we have tons of mosquitoes. Let's celebrate that. Summertime in Texas, what a perfect time to be here at Chalk Bluff. The summer in the park's just a way to start a long weekend. I want it to be about the San Marcos community, the music. It's about art history, it's about Sama history, and most importantly, it's about San Antonio history. Join us on our trip across Texas. Houston several times, but there's one area that we haven't discovered yet. It's just south of the city and it's the charming town of Clute. We actually happen to be here at a very special time because there's something unique going on. So let's go explore. This building, this is probably our main attraction. This is the art gallery, this area right here. They have the theaters in the back. Uh, we have a museum next door, and we have a, a planetarium down on the end. That NASA sends their astronauts down here to train there. Clute, this is our first time here, and I want to know about Clute. Clute is actually called the hub of Brazosport because we're pretty centrally located within our surrounding cities. You know, we have, of course, we have beaches, we have a, we have a lot of a lot of different opportunities to fish around here. You born and raised here. What is your absolute favorite thing about Clute? It is it is still a it's a fairly large little small town, but it, there's still a lot of hometown feeling around here. You know. Well, Wes, this is amazing already. Yeah, we're very proud of it. This is this is one of our major program areas here at the Center for the Arts and Sciences. This is our uh, malacology exhibit. And so what you see on top is really informative, beautiful. But if you look below, you'll see that every single one of these has a oh. set of drawers. And you know what? I, someone told me y'all have 20,000 seashells. Is that? Yes, that sounds <laughs> that about correct? right of the ones oh. that, are, that are actually displayed. A real highlight of the museum is this butterfly oh collection. Oh my gosh. Look at the beautiful colors. It's gorgeous, the iridescent colors and, and everything else. And again, it's just something that you can you can come here, you can look at it, you can you can learn more about, you know, the, the wildlife that lives around us. This gallery space, which is really fantastic. It's so colorful. It the is. The artwork is just eye-grabbing. This particular exhibit happens to be our Art League's uh, member challenge exhibit. Your members, this right. is their work. This How is awesome. Their work. Yeah, it's something we're really proud of. Now we're going to lift off into space. A lift off into outer space <laughs> here at the BASF Planetarium. It's a full dome planetarium. It's really special for an area this size to have. Oh, how cool. Yeah. This Inspire is really curiosity cool. and exactly. spark imaginations. That's what we're all about. I mean, that's what this about. whole place does, right? The entire, entire place. place. Yeah. Right. <laughs> Is Willie Manchu. He's the whole reason we're here. We're at the Great Texas Mosquito Festival, so let's do what we do best and have a good time. Woo! Oh, you smile! Oh, look at you! You are a, you are a ham. I got one! Finally! And it matches. We're here at the cook-off, and it's like a, almost like a food challenge, right? Correct. So what happens is we give them a surprise ingredient inside of a box. We, we present it to the team. The team has two hours to figure out what to cook and how to cook it, and they have to present it within a two-hour time limit. So today is day two here in Clute, and we're gonna make our way out to an iconic spot and then we're just itching to get back out to that mosquito festival.
We can start with the donut burger. Okay. I think that was the beginning of our, let's just be different okay. than anybody else. <laughs> yeah. So when I heard you had a donut burger, I thought, oh, they take a donut and they cut it in half. No, use two full donuts. If you're gonna have a donut <laughs> burger, you gotta do it right. <laughs> That is perfect. Sweet and savory. Yes. Y'all are located on Mammoth Lake. Yes. I think it was in like 2006. They found a, a mammoth uh, skull and husk. And then they had the a cast. And I'm sure y'all got yeah. that in the restaurant. Yeah. So it's oh, like, cool. a, you know, we're a part of history here. So the name of the restaurant is based on the name of? The mammoth. The mammoth, the mammoth is Aziel's, which means created by God. Very cool. Yeah. I love this. is kind of like a spiritual feeling going yes. on here. Yeah. I'm glad to hear that. That's our goal. Yes. Okay. We're in the restaurant business, but we love people. Back in the early 80s, folks were trying to figure out a way to make for a clue to make a name for itself. And the folks here are super resourceful and they said, we have tons of mosquitoes. Let's celebrate that. And, I love uh, it. It was a little bit tongue in cheek at first, but it's taken on a life of its own and become a, a symbol not just for a clue, but for the whole region. Right. And this guy right here. Willie Manchu. Yes. yes. Tell us a little bit about him. He's awesome. He was big before Facebook. We like to say that he was kind of one of the first uh, influencers in South te Southeast Texas. There's so many different things going on at the festival. Oh man, we've got so much going on. We do have a great carnival this year. Barbecue contest is epic and if you haven't made it over there to taste test you need to do so really quickly I was just for the sake of public safety I went by went through and got some ribs and okay. sampled just yes. a little bit okay, it's you. all official I'm trying to make sure folks are <laughs> safe uh, and then we have the, the mosquito calling contest and the mosquito leg contest uh, those are epic events and then uh, great music and that's kind of been our signature for a long time uh, from Selena in the 90s Stoney LaRue Robert Earl Keane We've been on a kind of a launching point for a lot of great acts coming out of Texas and we're excited to uh, continue that tradition. Once you elevate it and got it up, that's all you have to do. Okay, I gotta keep practicing. Awesome, thank you. Yes, thank you.